Alright, so really quick, I'm gonna try to make this tutorial really short. So we're gonna go in the order that I make my videos. The first thing you wanna do is add your intro. You go to add videos and uh, photos. <clears throat> click the video you wanna add. <clears throat> it got added all the way to the bottom, so you click it. Hold it right above where the editing stuff is, and then you just put it right there. Now my intro is at the start of my video. The next thing to do would be to add music. You click add music, find the music you want. As you can see, the music is playing while my intro is, which I don't want. So figure out how long your intro is. My intro is just about 8 seconds so what we want to do is we want to go to music tools it'll be up here right next to video tools <clears throat> go to music tools and then for your, the start time which i believe that's it you're gonna click eight so look it moved the starting of the music to right here or really right here um but the actual song doesn't start to play till later so it's fine if there's a little bit of green right there all these little squiggles is the music and the sound of it so right here it's really quiet anyways and then it gets louder up here now um if we go ahead and play it, i have no idea if you can hear my volume on my computer but let's go ahead and listen the music volume volume will be louder than my actual voice and i'm going to show you how to change that after this go for the swap rc and i didn't happen to make it and the so so as you can hear, it is a lot louder. So what you want to do is click music volume, turn it down. I usually put my video volume or my music volume about right there. Let's go ahead and listen to it now. Um, so if you haven't seen the video, I did go for the swap RC. See, like that's perfect. All you want to do is be able to hear the music. You don't want it to be too loud. You just want to be able to hear it. Anyway, so right here, we clearly have space. I'm going to show you how to make cuts now. You have a space right here. You have a random word, and I can guarantee you this word is um. Um exactly in all my videos i hate um i say um all the time while i'm recording and i just cut it out so there's a space right here i say um and then there's another space and an even longer space so what we're going to do is we're going to go and listen to what it sounds like right now story on that is, is that i i was previously in swap um see like that's garbage so what we're going to do is we're going to slide it to where we last talked the little slider we're going to go to video tools this right here is the main thing for making cut comps. You're going to click split. It'll add this little line right here. And then you're going to click record until we're um, the next time you start talking. And which is right here. And then we're going to drag the slider to where, like right before we start talking. Just so we don't trim any of the words. Then we click split. Right click uh, once you have this part selected. And then this part selected so it's separate from the whole video. Right click remove. Now let's go to listen to it. I, I was previously in swap and I ended up leaving. See, like that's so much better. Now real quick, let's say you want to add a clip that has a really sick reaction and you want to uh, dim or turn off the ga uh, the music volume so you can hear the, the reaction and the clip fully. You're going to go to music tools, split, and then once the little part that you want to that you want to cut or like move you once you select it it turns like a different color because like usually if it wasn't split it wouldn't change like that it would just all be the same no matter where you clicked but once it does that let's say this is your clip right here you're going to click right click remove on the green squiggles and then it will delete the music for that whole clip so that's a really short simple tutorial on how to make cut commentaries if you enjoyed please if you like it, please subscribe it means a lot and i guess i'll talk to you guys later if you have any questions, please feel free to comment down below. If there's anything you feel I left out and you would like to learn, again, please comment down below. I will try to get back to you as quick as I can so I can help you make your videos. See you guys later.